now let us look into the principles of energy management we have already discussed uh, the definition of energy management but there are some principles of uh, energy management and the definition of uh, energy management is utilization of uh, minimum quantity of energy for the task at appropriate quality neither better nor worse than needed task in energy use so we to undertake any task we use the energy so we should use the minimum quantity of energy to do the task that is the first uh, uh, need of ma energy management then to minimize the energy cost without affecting production or uh, production quality or quantity <coughs> third is energy forms of high quality high grade should not be used for low grade applications like uh, electrical energy is a high grade energy and this uh, heat is a low grade energy so you should not use electrical energy for heating purpose okay that use of high grade energy should be avoided for low grade applications and the fundamental goal of uh, energy management is to produce goods and provide services with the least cost and the least environmental effect <coughs> so now let us look at the principles of energy management uh, we should see the first historical energy use as i was telling you take your house electricity bill gas bills for the last two years so this is a historical energy use will come various forms of energy what is it usage over the years second is please undertake energy audits only when you undertake energy audit you will find out areas for improvement areas for energy conservation then third is housekeeping and maintenance so you have to maintain the house uh, properly means house means the industry factory shop floor and all and maintenance of equipment has to be done because maintenance if it is done that will reduce the energy intake by almost 10% whether it is your motorcycle your uh, refrigerator like a refrigerator you should do defrosting i can give an a simple example proper loading of refrigerator do not open the door frequently <coughs> then please analyze the energy usage pattern how it is being used energy use for various applications and try to have more efficient equipments see nowadays that uh, government of india be bureau of energy efficiency has star rating for equipment all the equipment like fan motor mixi tv fridge everywhere so you use five star rating equipment so that the energy is uh, utilization is less they are more energy efficient use more uh, ener efficient processes energy containment confine energy reduce losses and recover heat so especially uh, confine uh, energy containment when you are using boilers furnaces and all don't open the doors frequently even fridge don't open the door frequently that is containment then substitute materials uh, what happens sometimes you can substitute for the materials also then aggregation of energy sources different uh, sources can be aggregated like renewable and this conventional then use alternate energy sources so to the, do the same work like in case you are having electrical geyser for heating water you can change it from electrical to lpg gas geyser otherwise also you can change it to uh, solar geyser so these are alternate energy sources and construction of new facilities now you can have new facilities and manage the energy at the highest energy efficiency as i was telling uh, uh, highest energy efficiency means suppose you are using a pressure cooker for cooking food so there are different types of cookers light from 2 liters to uh, 10 liters so depending on the members of the family depending on the amount of food being cooked you use the right size of cooker okay similarly like traveling if one single person is traveling he can travel in a bike if four people are traveling then they can travel in a car if 40 people are traveling they can travel in a bus it is not even single person is traveling he uses a car or he uses a bus okay so you should use highest energy efficiency reuse and recycle energy by cascading uh, this is one good thing like uh, reuse and recycle energy by cascading cascading means like waterfall no water falls from one place to another place then falls from another place or even you can take your 
Kali River. It comes from that Dandeli, comes down to your Kadra, then Karwar. So it is cascading like. Likewise, this uh, this facility is available in power generation. You know, when huge amount of uh, energy used, like uh, coal is used. Uh, uh, suppose you take a case of thermal power plant. So coal is used for heating water and converting into steam, right? But the flue gases which are going, they have a lot of energy in that. So that heat is again used to heat the incoming water. That is called as economizer. The incoming water to the boiler is used. Then the same thing air uh, heat is used to heat the air coming into the boiler furnace. So that is known as air preheater. This way you are waste heat recovery also. We are trying to make recycle the energy and use most appropriate technology. As I was telling, technology is very important. Suppose in case of lighting, see lighting you have got uh, uh, incandescent bulbs, you have got tube lights, and you have got now LED lights. So these bulbs uh, are not very efficient. Okay, they get give less light. And consume more energy. Whereas now LED lights are more efficient, so you should go for appropriate technology like LED lights. Okay. Similarly, appropriate technology is there in all the facilities. Not only uh, I am giving you simple examples like in air conditioners, go for inverter-based AC. Okay. These are the new technologies or appropriate technologies, and reduce the available losses. Reduce the available losses means uh, whatever heat losses are there. You should try to reduce the losses, plug in the losses, and uh, lastly, economic evaluation. See, unless you evaluate, unless you monitor, unless you analyze, uh, unless you measure, you cannot make out any improvement program in your energy management. So definitely, you have to economic evaluation. And for economic evaluation, uh, we will be studying uh, the various methods of economic evaluation. Like present work te technique as well as future work technique in our subsequent discussions. Thank you.